Hello there everybody and welcome to HD Piano. My name is Dan and in this lesson we'll learn how to play postcards from far away by Coldplay. We'll look at part one of three in this first video. It sounds like this. Two, three, four. There's part one. Parts two, three, and the whole song run through. You'll find those at hdpiano.com when you wrap up learning part one. This is such a beautiful piece. It's so serene, and it's just a nice change of color from your normal pop song output that you get from Coldplay. I've got a question for you guys. Do you know any other bands or artists that are making music in this sort of genre, this neoclassical romantic styling? I know Ben Folds, for example, has some songs out there that would fit into this style. Comment below with your thoughts on that. Okay, so the right hand starts just above middle C on this F, and the left hand is way down here on a B flat. Let's look at the right hand first. It's rocking back and forth between this F and another note. The F is planted on this thumb, and then we alternate the top voice. And the top voice is A, B flat, C, D, A, B flat, C. Try that with me. Ready, and a one, and two, and three, and four, one, and two, and three, and four. Again, play. Rest. Listen, the left hand. So the left hand plays a single note followed by a chord. And that chord is a B flat chord, F, B flat, and D. Okay, see if we can just play that left hand. Can you make that jump? I'm going to add the right hand, see if you can as well. Try that again. And. Okay. Keep in mind, I'm playing a lot of sustain pedal. My hands let go, the notes continue ringing. That's the sustain pedal's work. Okay, so you're going to want to. Pretty much play the sustain pedal anytime a uh, chord changes. So I'm holding it down. I'm still holding it down. I'm going to lift because the chord changes. Right. So this next phrase starts off exactly the same on the right hand, but the top voice goes up. So we have that rocking back and forth between F, A, B flat, C, D, E flat, A, B. And all the while, the left hand is playing an E flat chord. It jumps up to this widespread chord. If you can't reach this octave here, welcome to just play these three notes. It's E flat, G, B flat, E flat. So we have. Rewind to the very beginning. We're going to play up to that point super, super slow. Ready? And a uh, ready play. And. Okay, moving on. It's the exact same as the first phrase, and now we have a different phrase. I like this part. 
The right hand starts on a grace note. The grace note is one that we just flick. It's F to G. And we sort of just tickle that note right there. Ever so subtly. And then we'll do the same with that C. So it's really just this. But we have those couple notes inserted. Okay. And with the left hand, it looks like this. Doing a little crossing there, the hands. It's fun. Okay. So that rounds out part one. Let's go back to the very beginning of part one. Play it all super duper slow. Two and. Ready and play. Let's try part one at a medium tempo. And two and ready and play. How about recorded tempo? This is about 125 beats per minute at a recorded speed. One and two and ready and play. We have it guys that's part one we're one third of the way through postcards from far away by coldplay head on over to hdpiano.com to learn parts two three and then watch me perform the whole song again my name is dan and i would love to hear from you on social media we're on twitter at hdpiano and you can send us your song requests there on instagram shoot us a clip of something that you've learned a video clip and we'll likely repost it for our followers to see on Facebook, throw us a thumbs up. And on YouTube, subscribe if you haven't yet. Uh, really excited to finish this one, guys. Postcards from Far Away by Coldplay. I'm Dan. I'll see you at hdpiano.com, the home of the hybrid piano lesson. <laughs>